for cooking and cleaning. He watched football all evening. I never thought feelings. I never had a dad like the Gafferts. I had the one who sung on Joni Mitchell two octaves higher than me. Held open the page belts of picture books till one of us fell asleep. He taught there's nothing I couldn't possibly achieve. Never advocated his, never advocated misogyny and raised his daughters properly to live long and prosper free. And I remember, eight years old, laughing because he listened to a woman's hour. As if it is funny that a man gives words for words of feminine power, because at that age, the world is pink by numbers. Primary colours, pink and blue, and all seem invested in the truth that there's some kind of fundamental difference between the two. But I had the dad who drew horizons without boundaries, forged my foundations like a fire from a foundry, and I found he was never the kind of dad who acts blokey. The kind who drinks eight pints in one night and says mate, colloquially. But I had the one who opened me, convinced me I could butter barriers with syllables, that existence is a miracle to engage in things political. And even though sometimes things are difficult, I have a man who is indivisible from the sum of my being. Encouraged dreaming was well-rounded and present, a female voice advocate, and that's why I never had a dad like the dad bird.